I agree with everything Chairman Aguilar said. As you saw what happened this term, uh, Democrats were their adults in the room, and we put up the votes on critical bills to prevent a catastrophic default on our nation's debts, to keep our government running. And what are Republicans doing? Stupid stuff. Literally today, they're holding yet another hearing trying to impeach Hunter Biden with like some guy named Tony Bobulinski. Like, who is that guy? Like, why does America even care? The star witness for the Republicans was recently indicted by the Department of Justice for lying about Hunter Biden and Joe Biden. And public reporting is that that star witness also met with Russian intelligence. So literally, we have the Republicans doing stupid stuff, spreading Russian disinformation. And you have Democrats here trying to help American families and trying to make sure that our country moves forward. I think some of us were just surprised. Usually, Republican witnesses get indicted after they testify to Congress. They're actually bringing in someone from jail to testify. Uh, so um, it's just an interesting turn of events. Uh, but Criticism arises against Ted Lieu's characterization of the Republican Party's actions as mere stupid stuff while centering on the impeachment of Hunter Biden. Lou's commentary reflects a clear partisan bias against Republicans, showcasing a reluctance towards constructive dialogue or bipartisan efforts. This stands in stark contrast to his analysis of Hunter Biden's depiction of Republicans, portraying them engaging in activities perceived as frivolous or politically motivated. Lejeu argues that Democrats, in contrast, prioritize addressing critical national issues. Hunter Biden's statements serve as a microcosm of the prevailing narrative in political discourse, where both sides seemingly prioritize scoring political points over constructive engagement and substantive policy discourse. 